Hey guys. Hello world. We're finally you're back. Yes, we're what? back. You're, you're saying your Jesse works with me. Hello world. Is that <laughs> what you want to get nearly? Oh my god. Yeah, thank you. Oh, you're welcome, chat. <laughs> okay, uh, yeah, we're finally doing uh, another album review. Yes. Why is it always my albums that always get the way? Because your albums are shit. We don't want to listen okay. to them. On God! I think I think Tanya's had the worst track of albums, but you know. No, whatever. no. Pilot album okay, I only. Yeah, that is fair. Whatever. Um, I gave the best album. Is that mean West and Both the Ground? I I gave the best album. Uh huh. Uh huh. So this this album we're doing today is 40 Ounces to Freedom by Sublime. Yes. I keep saying of freedom. I don't know why. I would like yeah, to Yeah, no, I kept that. doing that too. <laughs> uh, yeah, so this is 40 Ounces to Freedom, released by Sublime in 1992. It has 22 songs and takes an hour and nine minutes to complete. It also takes that long for to finish the siege game, apparently. Oh, yeah, no, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> whatever, whatever. I'm not gonna shit on Jet any more than I already have. Um. Yeah. All right. Let's get into it with the first song. We Tanner, play. What was your scoreboard? What was your scoreboard on the game? Uh, three five. So it we kind of had to go to match point a lot. Jittle Yang. Okay. Oh, it was just a Jittle Yang. First song. Let me play it. Yes. That first song is waiting for my room. Alright, um, obviously this song, he, uh, his vocals are like way different than the uh, entire album. Um, I don't know if he, uh, well obviously he did that on purpose, but I mean I don't know if it was like a thing where he wanted to like make people think that was how the whole album was gonna be. And then he completely changed his voice. But yeah, yeah. It is a pretty you know goofball move. Yeah, bro just baited the whole audience. Yeah, he's kind yeah. of a he's kind of a master at it. Master bait. Wait. <laughs> 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 Why did I think that as well? <laughs> <laughs> sorry, I was looking at Tenor's profile picture. Sorry. Okay. What? No, that's really weird. What? I was also looking at Weston's profile picture. Thanks, that's not a real person. Leo! It's Leon oh S. Oh, Le Le not Leo, Leon. Not Leo. Same thing, bro, just without the N. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Uh, anyway, the, mu the music. Yeah, the music. Yes. Um. I would give it a... 8. Oh, damn, we, like, barely talked about it. Um, Waiting for My Ruka. It was a fun, groovy song. Um, It was purposely goofy with his vocals yeah. which is, I yeah. thought it was still good and for some reason this song trended on TikTok for like a week I don't know why like when it was like a few months ago in like oh. January it trended a on TikTok a for a little bit. I don't remember that it wasn't that big but I just like saw it on my for you page a little bit mm. um uh. but yeah I'd give uh, I'd, I'd give I don't want to say the whole song his name is too long I'd give this song a flat, flat eight, flat eight out of ten. Okay, Jillian. I give this song a seven. Yeah, I think I think it's different. Oh, sorry, sorry. It's all different. It's seven, eight, nine. Right, you get a nine, right? Wait, you give it a nine? You give it a nine? I give it an eight. Oh, okay. So it's, it's all the same. Right. Where'd nine come from? Yeah. Oh, I think I heard. I thought I heard tennis say nine. I was like, what the Jillian? Oh, I said flat eight. <laughs> oh yeah, I said yeah. Forty uh, ounce to freedom, the yes. title so track. Song. Title track. Restore forty ounces to freedom. The that one. Um. By the way, all these songs are extremely nostalgic to me. So. Uh. I don't know why. I just kind of, for me, I just kind of felt this title, this song was a little bit out of rhythm. Um, but the guitar was good, and his vocals are great. Um, his vocals are really good throughout the whole album, but this is when I first started seeing it. I feel like, um, yeah. maybe it's out of, uh, rhythm, sounds like, because, I think it might be because it's just a different style of music. It's, 
I think that's the style he wants. Maybe. I guess. You know, um, this this whole album is like beachside music. Oh yeah, it's, like, rig it's oh, ska, punk, yeah. or reggae. Oh yeah. yeah. Well, yeah, this is a California band, you know. California yeah. love. No, that's Tupac. <laughs> Um, California Cation. That's dude. not Tupac. Um, dude. I'd give a song. I give California Love like a solid. Uh, I give California Cation. Bro, a, California uh, Love is like a ten out of ten song, bro. <laughs> what about California Girls? That's also a ten. That's also yeah. a ten. <laughs> That's how you say Okay. Okay. Forty ounces of freedom. Uh. A strong nine for me. Damn! What the fuck? <laughs> I'm gonna be extremely biased here. Okay. I give it a strong seven. I gave it a flat seven, bro. <laughs> He's living in a single room with three other individuals. All right, smoke two joints. This is what uh. Do you guys? You do know, you guys I shouldn't know say whenever anything. I. Do you guys constantly hear when I say, uh, you know, uh, hold on. What are you? Forgot, what are you saying? I, I'm having a stroke. I'm literally having a stroke right now. Take your time. Oh yeah, smoke cigarettes till the day she dies. You know how I constantly say that all the time. No. Oh, you don't? No. no I've, 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 I've like, like never I've, yeah, that. I've never heard you say that, Jay. I say that all the time. I call it like smoke cigarettes till the day she dies. I have, I never, have heard never heard, you, heard you utter those words. Smoke you are doing. The day she dies. You are smoking two joints. I was trying to like right implant per his personality okay. into Jay, our minds. You, Jay, you are smoking two joints right now. Okay, whatever. Oh, so like kind of like sixteen joints that you smoke <laughs> in one day. The song's got like a Quinn Tarantino ass opening. For real? Yeah, for Let real. Let me play it. She's living in a single room with three individuals. Man, I don't even know what we were up to in there. Furthermore, Susan, I wouldn't be the least bit surprised to learn that all four of them habitually smoked heroin. Marijuana cigarettes. Reefers. <laughs> Reef. Um, I thought this song was. What the fuck? Sorry, I was gonna make the sound of the bomb, but I don't know. Okay. Um, <laughs> I thought this song was pretty cool. Um, the. Felt very hip hop, which I did not expect going into this album. Um, and the Easy E sample was a huge W. I don't know if I. I mean, I know you guys don't know who Easy E is, but he's a. Legend. I heard the Easy E sample. Easy. Yeah. <sighs> Legendary rapper. Um, but I thought it was cool. I gave this song a strong eight. I liked it a lot. Hey, strong eight. Hmm. I gave it a light eight. Okay. Um. This is kind of embarrassing. <laughs> This, this song is this is like the song that I've known my entire life. Uh, for the song play a million times before I even knew what the name was. Okay. Even though it's very obvious, I give it a ten. Oh, Damn. Dog. Jen, I'm revoking. Ten I'm, is crazy. I love that song. I'm revoking no. your title for having the best music taste in the friend group. It's Weston now. Oh, because yeah. of one song that you don't even <laughs> care about. No, I'm joking. You, I'm joking. Um, okay. That's still wild, though. 10 out of 10 for that song is wild. That um, is, that's that song one is, is like the, one of the catchiest songs in the world to me. Smoke two joints in the gift. I'm sorry, that song is, is just it, so You think it's better than Everlong? <sighs> Jet? I won't state my opinion of that. <laughs> I don't want to offend anyone here. The video would be too long. The video would be too long, yeah. Okay, fair. If we, if we go on a month long. <laughs> month is crazy. Yeah, I don't, I don't think that's a possible upload on YouTube, uh, Jay. Okay, okay. Uh, next song. You, someone yes. else read that. I'm too lazy. He's big ass title. We're only We're gonna, gonna only die for arrogance. arrogance. Let me it's play it. Our arrogance. Our arrogance, right. Another gold. Whatever. Another empire. Started his own kind. He died a confused man. He kills over his own mind. Let's go! Um, I love this song. I thought the song went crazy, bro. I love the slight bongos you can hear in the back. And the guitar is always great. So, I like this song. I give it a light nine. Dude, that part of 125 went absolutely insane. What are you talking about? The solo at 125. Or not really solo, but just like the song went crazy. Oh, yeah. I gave this song a line nine. 
I had a, song, a flat eight. Jet. Okay, I'm gonna reiterate this again. I really like this album. <laughs> I give this song a ten. Oh, <laughs> I don't know. I do not. I do not give every song a ten on this album. But it sounds like it. Bro. No, don't worry, don't worry. The next song it will not be a ten. Okay. Now, now I can't guarantee you. Maybe the the next couple of songs that there might not be a ten, but I I, I will reiterate. Okay, not all <sighs> songs in here are a ten, but I must reiterate. This is a good album to me. Reiterate. Okay, let's go. Let's continue. Oh my god. Don't okay. push, which is like, I like this one. Don't push. Let me play it. So I'm from the African man. Chase down with a knife. Find the rhyme, get a waterfall. Oh, yeah, no, I got it. Lynn from an African man. Um, I love the Bob Marley in this and the beachy vibes have been going crazy on this song. I haven't really said it yet, but I think all the drums, like, so far, like, are really, are really good. Yeah. Um, I gave Don't Push a flat eight. Flat um, seven. Okay, Jesus. I give it like a flat nine. Uh, <laughs> seven, eight, nine. Yeah. Okay. Seven, eight, nine. Um, okay. Five, four, He's not four, read it. five, four, four. No, I got this. I got this. <laughs> five, okay. five, four, four, six. That's my number. Okay. Slash ball and chain. Oh, okay. I'm the MVP. Oh my God, he actually did it. Oh, okay. I'm crazy. Let me explain something with this line. So five, four, four, six is uh, that's my number. Is a reggae song. It's an actual just normal reggae song, right? That's pretty good. Um, and then my ball and chain is a different song that they created, and they just combined the two songs. Uh, so you know, you notice how the song kind of changes halfway. Uh, yeah. Where it's where it's where he's talking about uh, you know being in prison, then he talks about having a kid. Yeah, those are the two songs. Interesting. Yeah. Let me play it real quick. I uh, absolutely adore this song. Yeah, I think this one's good. I I really want to learn the bass line for this one. The bass line for this one's really. Oh good. yeah, the doom 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 doom. Yeah, the bass line was nice. Um, what did I write for this? Um, I had this one a strong eight. Uh, this song, there was a lot of cool stuff that I liked about it. The trumpets were cool, and the uh, <clears throat> the female getting penetrated was very interesting to hear. What? You did not hear you that? You didn't catch that, Weston? <laughs> I don't remember that. <laughs> Didn't she just say? Did yeah? Did she say like "come in my pussy" or something in the middle Wait, of the song? Wait, where? <laughs> yeah. It was, they, so for so for this album, for this album, they would sample actual just porn. <laughs> yeah, that's interesting. Jess, say that loud because you like murmured. Cause so so the so the juke podcast. They, they, they sample they sample pornographic material in the album. Can you say that again, like louder? I'm, I'm going like, through no. looking. So I'm everyone looking in your through house the lyrics right now, trying to find this. I'm pretty sure she says something like "come in my pussy" or some shit like that. <laughs> yeah, something like that. Yeah. Um, but this song was really good. Still, the guitar is great as always, and I gave it a light nine. Did you give it less? I said strong eight. Okay, this is the last ten. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ! Unless I remember a song and I forgot, this is the last ten. Uh, bad fish. Um, did you, did you know this song before uh, the album? I think I'm going crazy. I can't find it. It's the next song. Uh, no, no, not the song. I was I was trying to find the audio clip. I was I was going oh. through the I was going through it. And I was like, where is it? I'm, I I don't remember this. Oh. Uh, the acoustic at the beginning is really good for bad fish. Well, there's an entire other song. I think it's uh, right back or one of those where it's literally just like, oh, you know, my balls. What? There's, a, there's one song where he goes, where, where you just hear a sucking sound on here is, no, like my balls. <laughs> I don't remember that. And then another one is, uh, oh, damn, you biting this shit. Oh, Jesus. Bro, okay, that has know, to hurt so not bad if come... bite. Okay, Ted is not coming back anytime soon, so it's up a bad fish. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. What are your opinions on Bad Fish? Uh, well, okay, I'm, 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 I'm not, so not going to give it a 10. I'm not going to give it a 10. Here, here. Okay. But this is a very nostalgic song because I also knew this song when I was younger. Uh, the, 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 the beat of this is very nostalgic. Even though it's very similar, I can tell the difference. It's, yeah. 
I like the whole uh, okay, fish theme of bad fish. Bad fish. Oh, we're on bad fish. Um. Yeah, they also talk about a big, big blue whale. Yeah, when we were listening, I said, "Oh, was he talking about Leah?" <laughs> yeah, he did say that yeah. when we were uh, <laughs> when we were listening. He did say that. I remember. Um. Let's see. Uh, I love the acoustic guitar in this song at the end and beginning. Um, yeah. And there were just so many like different string sounds in this song. It was pretty beautiful, to be honest. Um, I give the song a flat nine. I give this song I... probably like a uh, flat nine, but well, yeah. Give it an eight. Okay, Weston did not like this song, did he? Oh, Jet. Oh, no. You got not as much you as guys I realize, know. like, 8 out of 10 I, I literally is still, just like, said, not as great. Much Tanner, he's below the average of rating. I'm below the average of what you guys are saying. I think yeah. you guys overhyped this a little, to be honest. Okay. Well, you overhyped Everlong, so, you know, go play. I, I did not. <laughs> go, go, go I did not overhype that. Oh, my I God. I swear sometimes. Okay. Uh, uh, let's go is. get stoned, guys. Sometimes oh my you're a god. Whore. Let's go get stoned is the next yeah, song. Let's go get stoned. Oh, this no, is the song that goes. the next song. Okay. This, is the, this is the song that goes. Damn, I live my mom. I said. I said. I said. Shit. I said. Shit. I said. I said. I said. I said. I You're buying this shit. <laughs> oh, yeah. Um. It was a cool song. Um. You gotta love the porn sound effects that were in this. Very, yeah. uh. Very interesting. Yeah. Uh, and I also like the R&B noises that were at the end of the song. That was cool. Yeah, I guess, uh, I guess that was pretty cool. Uh, I gave this song a strong 8 out of 10. Cardiac Central Blue. Cardiac Central Blue. Uh, I gave it a flat 9. Dang. I also gave this one a flat 8. I mean, I gave it a strong eight, so I don't know what you're on about. Yeah, like you said, I also gave it. Like, no one's uh, with you, bro. No as, one's as with you. We're against to... you. We're against you. I also gave the, 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 a flat eight in reference to the last song, which I gave the same score. Oh. Yes. Okay. <laughs> New thrash. Let me play it. Me play New it. thrash. New thrash, bro. New thrash, bro. <laughs> Um, oh, this one uh, went hard. Oh yeah, I thought the song was a great break from the reggae, and yeah. it was amazing and very fast paced. So I liked it a lot. I didn't like it as much because it reminded me of uh, Green Day. <laughs> what? Green Day is uh, uh, Green Day. I was, uh, I was not like American Idiot. I do not like. I do not like American Idiot. Well, that's what da, 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 da. you are, Jet. So. I'm an American idiot. No! <laughs> okay, uh, I gave this song a light nine out of ten. Light nine out of ten. I gave this one a flat nine. Damn! Jesus Christ. Okay, I give it a seven. Damn. Hmm. I think that was the outlier uh, this time. I think we see our. Uh, okay. Never mind. Scarlet think... Bodegas. That's Scarlet Bogonis in the Touch of the Blues. <laughs> Okay, let me play it. This is another bass line I want to learn. I like this song. This, this song, I think, has to be my favorite sound of the album. Not my favorite song, but my favorite sound. I yeah. love the sound. The sound. Just, like, I've never been wrong when I've never been. That, that, that's such, like, the whole, the whole sound of this song is so good. Yeah, yeah I, I, I really. It has, like, a bluesy, jazzy part of the song. I really like the different noises to this song. I thought it was really good. I like the, bum, na, na, dun, 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 after every verse. Um, yeah. I give this song to go to a, concert for a strong eight. I gave this one a flat nine. I give this one a strong nine. Oh, oh hell no, bro! The, 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 the I'm gonna talk about the comment that Jet made like before, bro. A what? concert with these people would be so lame. <laughs> I would what? not be I would not be bumping to some reggae at a I concert. could see like these people playing at like oh no. You would maybe, not like... wanna you, you would not wanna bump to some reggae damn you no. lame bro. I reggae would, is not like concert music. I would smoke weed to reggae, but I would not bump to reggae at a concert. Okay, well you do not you do not do drugs, Tanner so. Well if I did, you know. Then I, I then I would do it I would do it to this album. Years old. 
Then it's okay. I don't care. <laughs> but at this age, it's not okay. It's against the law. You know what I meant. Um, also, okay, next song, Live at Ease. I really like this song. Is this supposed to be I an Easy like E reference to? Uh, I, no, I think Live at Ease is probably like a, 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 a place where they were live at. But uh, I, li I like the part where it goes, uh, Eric, sing some. My name is Eric and I have nothing to say because I'm not a fucking DJ. And if you want to come talk to me, then you gotta talk to my man Brad Lee. Uh, elected. <laughs> yeah, yeah like, this this was a funny song. Um, no, but the part that did go hard was oh, elected. My rhymes have been perfected. In, in that part, it was a yeah. funny song. I just didn't think it was very mixed well, and some things didn't fit where they were. Like these, the weird jingles. Um, well, it's live. It is live. That's fair, but still, I I don't really like when um. When people put live songs on on albums, but I mean, uh, You're gently yeah, so I guess I, that's fair. I gave this one a flat seven. Flat seven. I'll give this a flat eight. I just wasn't a big fan of this one, so I gave it like a strong six. <laughs> Valid. Bro was just hating today, bro. Bro, bro woke up and was just like, God damn, I hate people. <laughs> <laughs> nah. <laughs> Bro, just woke up today and just wanted to fucking let people down. No, I'm I'm actually a pretty happy person, so I'll wake up hating. Yeah. I'm gonna start, I'm gonna, I want to make this video get age sick if you want to stop talking. No. <laughs> <sighs> All right, DJs. DJs. Bullet in the. Play the song. Now I gotta be honest. During this one, the whole like AJ lore thing happened. So like, I was reading at the same time that I was listening to this one. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about, but we'll I talk about it. Tanner, are you in the Tanner? You're in the well, server. Right? Um, or... I wanna. We'll get in in engaged in the tea later. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah my bad. Okay. Um, I feel like this song is kind of beautiful. This song is kind of like pretty. Oh, I was yeah. starting to get boring of the reggae stuff at this song. <laughs> okay, well, you're kind of boring too. I can uh, listen to this album for like 24 hours straight. It's still really I cannot good. listen to reggae for like no. more than like Okay, I mean minutes. like his singing is nice. Uh it's still a really fun. fun song and I enjoyed it, but I was just kinda of being like, Yeah, I mean I'd rather listen to something else right now, but I have to for the album. <sighs> so I gave When I listen to Twenty One Pilots Tenor, every time you you choose an album, I don't want to listen to Twenty One Pilots anymore after one song. So, you know, each and I <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Damn. Um, I give DJs a strong seven. I give it, uh, yeah, probably a strong seven. No, yeah, I give it a flat eight. No, I give it a strong eight. No, I give it a strong nine. Light yeah. seven. I give it a light seven. I give it a strong eight. Okay, okay, strong eight. Chica Matapo. That is not what that says. <laughs> no, I, I don't speak, I don't speak, uh, Jerusalem. Chica mi, what? <laughs> I don't speak Spanish. Chica mi tipo. Chica mi tipo. Weston, you're in Spanish and you said it wrong too. Huh? I said Chico Mi Tipo. You said Tipio. Did I? Yeah. Oh, Chica I Mi tipo. tipo. I meant to say Tipo. Even um, though this is in a different language, I like this song. I really enjoyed the, the Espanol yeah. in this song. Um, and the guitar. No, like the hard guitar beats were great. And I was yeah. like, this was a really nice change for me. I enjoyed it. Um, I gave this song a strong 8 out of 10. I gave this a. Uh... Nine out of ten. Cardiac sensor deployed. I had this one a strong seven. Cardiac sensor deployed. No, I think. Oh wait, I forgot to play. Has a has a has an okay feeling about Reagan. Yeah, no, you 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 pinned it down. All right. Pin that. Okay. Right back. Right back. Shit. Okay, this song. I love this song as well. Okay. I don't know if you guys. Okay. I said I said the thing about you know, uh, the cigarette thing and how I say that all the time. But this song I do I I'll, I constantly say, my girlfriend said so. She's a little hoe. I okay. I've heard you say that one before. I've yeah. heard you say that one before. This I haven't song. heard that one, but I've, I've heard you say that she's a little hoe part before. I've heard you say that. Oh yeah, yeah. Sleeping by yourself tonight. Let me Make play it. Sleeping by yourself. Okay, um, this song was fun. 
I don't really know what else to say. It's kind of just been the same. Um, yeah. But I like this song still. I give it a light eight. Okay. I had this one a seven. I give this a strong nine. Damn. Let's keep moving so you guys don't talk about it. <laughs> okay, what happened? I like this song is very. This is the funniest song, bro. What is that smell? <laughs> Let me play it. That awful smell. She may be an angel. Um, I don't know if it was just me, but I like swear, like I'm like 95 percent that there was like the tequila beat. Uh, like you know the. I'm like, the fucking, from Mexico. Yeah, I, know what you, I know what you're talking about, but like, oh, you got those from Mexico. Like, I don't know. Like, well, like, I swear, I like remember when I was listening to the song, there was a definitely the beat to tequila. <laughs> yeah, the bum, ba, da, 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 dum, dum. that was definitely oh, yeah. the song. Um, so that's why I really like this song, and I thought it was pretty cool and interesting. So I gave it a strong eight. Oh, I found it. Yeah, yeah that's that for me. That part was, yeah, that part was really good. This song is pretty funny though. Strong eight, strong eight. Yeah. What is this shit on my face? Flood it, flood it. When did he say that? Who is this girl on my bed? What is this shit on my face? My I'm gonna God, shit what on is your that face. Awful smell. Uh, give this a uh, no one heard that. flat nine. Wait, what'd you give it, Weston? I said okay. Friday at first, but like uh, I'm kind of starting to change my mind. I think it's better than, you know, I'm gonna give a strong eight, a strong eight. All right. Um, new song. I kind of do not like this song. Let me play it. New song. Oh, I didn't like this one. Yeah, no, um, I didn't like this one either. I uh. I don't like the effect on his voice at all. Yeah, no. Bro, bro was using a bit of all too. I'm looking what at my was notes. You using a little bit of oh. I'm looking at my notes and I think I just didn't care about the song because in my notes yeah. it says it just says cool. I just put cool for the song and then put okay. strong seven. So yeah, I give this song a strong seven. I gave this one a five. I did not like it. <laughs> I'm gonna give it a uh, five seven. Uh. I did not like the, the sound effect. Wow, I had the okay. highest rating. Okay. Okay, this is the song that introduced me to the album, even though I knew all these songs almost, but yeah, I just told, did not know what those told yeah. that those are. Yeah, I love this song. This who the song fuck, was so good. Who the fuck is Dude, I like, I like, I like how, I like how she's talking about his strength. Like every single like race group. <laughs> yeah, I know every every single fucking radical group besides the CIA. <laughs> who? Wait, I, I think I know. Everyone's cool with the way. I think I know why Weston can... likes this song. Huh? I think I know no, why Weston likes this song. No, I know why Weston likes it. It's because of the, it's because of like the microphone esque noise, like the staticky microphone noise that he put on his voice. My friend, yeah. Epic is a Nazi. yeah, no, I like that effect a lot. You know, I like the. I thought you were gonna say something very different. No. <laughs> uh, for my notes in this song, I put "Who the fuck is Eben?" and then I gave it a light eight. So. Why is he <laughs> such a radical? <laughs> He's cold kicking, live living with the KKK. Damn. So what do you guys give this song? A ten. I, mean, I, hate a ten. I gave this yeah. one a ten too. I love this one. I thought yeah, you I said thought, yeah. that. Okay, do not say the full name of the next one. I thought you said that Ball and Chain was your favorite. Is the last ten. Well, I lied. So kill I mean, blow whoa! Your no! Me no! Off. No! <laughs> Date blank. I also like this one a lot. Date blank. Yeah. Date uh, blank. Date what I do to. I mean, date what I do to Weston. That's what the title what? is. What? What? Um. I don't remember this. I must have been asleep. Date what I did to your dog. Okay. <laughs> what? That is crazy. Let me. Actually, I don't even know if I should play the song. I'm not gonna play the song. Yeah, you should. Um... <laughs> yeah, don't don't play the song. Do not play the oh, song. Don't don't don't. don't. Um. It's a very interesting title, uh, and the lyrics are also very concerning. The guitar goes crazy. The lyrics are very concerning, but other than that, it's a bop. The song is a bop. <laughs> this song is a bop. This song's a, this song's a bop. The song is a bop. I, I really like the bass line and drums for this one. They were so good. Yeah. yeah. The lyrics are also really good besides uh, some questionable parts, but we don't talk about that. Uh, I gave this song a flat eight, just like Jet's bottom. I also gave, I gave this one a strong nine. I gave this one a flat nine. 
Jed. Did you hear what I said about your bottom? Yeah. You have a flat bottom. Oh, flat bottom, girl, man. Well, I hope it's okay. Uh, uh, uh. Get it? Get it? What? Get it? I, I hope it's okay. And like the, like, oh, it's the oh, next yeah. song! Oh, oh my god, he's yeah. so creative. You should, like, yeah, please yeah, stop yeah. living. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let me play Hope real quick. I'm just like that. Um, this one went kind of hard. Yeah, this one went hard. Okay, yeah. can you... <sighs> I like how... Uh, okay, I think Tanner... I think Weston and Tanner have the complete opposite opinion. Tanner said that the album went hard in the beginning, and then at the end it fell off. But then I feel like Weston... Uh, the album went harder for Weston at the end. Yeah, no, it did. Mm. Okay. Yeah, you guys had different um, opinions. I feel like it went hard throughout the entire thing. The end kind of dropped off for me, though. I, I like... A couple... Well, Jay, we're not done talking about the whole album yet. you get over the Manala Segan to you, you little delegate. Manala Segan. Manala Um, okay. <clears throat> this song went hard, and I thought the drum and guitar mix was very good. It was a great yeah. mix. Uh, I love Sublime. I gave Hope a strong 8 out of 10. I gave <laughs> I gave this one a light 9. I guess what a flatty. The burp. Okay. Burp. Oh, I just puked in my mouth. Okay. Oh. I don't remember this song for some reason. Car S1. Car I remember Car. this song. I'm not remembering that. Yeah. Because he's <laughs> This is the only. This is the only song that's uh, that you know isn't. Um. It was a fun guitar. I liked the tune. Um, I'm not sure what a KRS one is, but it's a good I song. Flat this whole, eight. This one was great. I also gave it a right. flat eight. I gave it a strong eight, Jell Yugen. Jell Yugen. Jell Yugen. Oh, KRS one is a uh, an American hip hop artist. Ooh. Oh, okay. Interesting. Sublime is so white, it's crazy. <laughs> they're so white. I, they're I so only white, look... but like, at the same time, they're so like, I don't know. The first song that I heard from Sublime was, uh... I always was thought they were Hispanic. Was uh, I thought... Wait, what, so what was the song name? Uh, Written from Aruka? Is it off this album? Do In Time. It's not on this album. Oh, okay. It's on, oh. It's on Sublime. No, the album's I thought we should... Yeah, and I... I didn't realize they were white. <laughs> Really? Yeah, I didn't realize. I knew it. I knew they were just like because they're sublime. Yeah, the party, yeah that's the doing time is a pen as well. And then I clicked on their profile and saw, and I was like, you know what, that makes sense. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I always thought they're Hispanic though. Really? Yeah, I always thought they're Hispanic. Hispanic? I would have. Yeah, when I was I don't, kid, I don't think it's Hispanic. I would have never guessed that. <laughs> I would have but never guessed that. Then it made more sense that they'd be white. Yeah. All right. Okay, uh, Rivers of Babylon. Oh Let my God! Play. It's that movie. Yeah, it's that movie. It's... No way. Tanner, you should just review Babylon for this one. Yeah, All right. Tanner, um, so in the beginning, so in the beginning of Babylon, there's this. In the beginning, 30, there is the heavens and the there's earth. There's this. Shut the fuck up. There's this 30 minute scene where um I forgot the main character's name, but um I just got removed from the Discord call. Hold on, guys. I hate I you. It. I hate you. <laughs> just, give, just give your score from, for Babylon on this song, okay? Okay, um, I thought the singing was great on this song. Um, the lyrics and acoustic guitar playing was awesome. I, this was Roddy's just like song. a really soft song, and I liked it a lot. So we're just um, gonna ignore what Jet said. What'd you say? Mar I heard Margaret, I heard Margaret Robbie. <laughs> <laughs> I said Margaret Robbie's really hot. <laughs> That's great to hear. Um, <laughs> she's in she's in Babylon. Yeah, she is. You know what? Never mind. I gave this song a strong eight out of ten. Courtney, a boy. Courtney, a boy. You should like this one. Eight out of ten. I gave it a strong eight. <laughs> okay, thanks. thanks. 
I like this. I like this song because it's very funny because it's just them thanking people. Oh, I this didn't... is the YouTube outro of music. I like this. I just put yeah. a thank song. Pretty cool. I didn't give it a number rating because it wasn't a song. He thanked Jimi Hendrix at the end. Okay. Hey up, hey up to Jimi Hendrix to the that beer, is that is the... no 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 that is major D writing. I I know. He thanked Bad Religion. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, bad religion, Bob Marley. Most of the people that he, <laughs> most of the people that he thanked, I have no idea who they are. How about the butthole surfers and things. Oh, I know the butthole surfers. We talked about yeah. the mascots. Remember? Yeah, no, we were talking about the butthole surfers. Okay, this song is a ten because they uh, thank Jimmy Hendrix. Okay, I didn't give a number to this song, but if you're actually giving it a ten, that's wild. I gave this one a seven. Okay, I'm gonna give it a. No, I'm joking. I'm gonna give it like a, a flat eight. Uh, it's not really a song, it's just them thinking people with a beat in the background. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's really honestly what it is, though. Yeah. Alright, um, that's the whole album, guys. Sublime. Yeah, it is. 40 Ounce to Freedom. Now, what were your guys' least favorite songs on this album? Oh, right, I forgot about this um, part about it. Uh, <laughs> least favorite. Least favorite. What was that one song called? Uh... The one with the auto tune. I'm trying to remember. Live at ease. That... New song. New song. New song. Oh yeah, no. Yeah. yeah. Song my least favorite, actually. Yeah. I think my yeah. least favorite was "Live at Ease" because it just wasn't. I just didn't really like the mixing. You mean on "Live it. at Ease"? Live at Ease. <gasps> <laughs> Wait, it says. Yeah, it says "Live." Am I live. stupid? No, it says "Live." Tanner, you know it's spelled the same way, right? Oh. Live and live are the same thing, but live is usually mean like you're in person, you know, it's it's live in front of you, you know, it, you know what I mean, Tanner. Okay, fine. <laughs> what was okay, favorite songs. No, what was, wait, what was your least favorite yet? New song, it's the new song. Oh. Yeah. Favorites. Eben. Okay. What? Eben. Okay, fair, yeah. Um, 54, 46, that's my number, Ball and Jen. Okay, okay, but which one's better? Jet. <laughs> which one? Oh, uh, 5446 is better. Really? I think Ball and Chain is way better. I was like, what the fuck is this song? Uh, anyways, my favorite. Yeah, no, it's what? only. What? I don't I It's difficult, but yeah, both of the. I mean, I'm gonna combine them as one song, right? But, you know. Yeah. Um, uh, but then also, We're All Gonna Die From Our is a goaded song. I don't care anything. What song? Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. It's a yeah. good song, too. Okay, Tanner, what's your favorite um, song? My favorite is probably Bad Fish. Okay. But well, You knew the song before, you know. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but it was very close for between 5, 4, fucking whatever. And 54, 46, Tanner. It's a <laughs> yeah. prison number. That song, it was very. That song was very close, but I, I like. I really like that fish. Sure. Weston, what? Oh, you already said. You said it. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I'm pretty sure I was the I first think, one to say it. Yeah. I, yeah, you were just so fast. I didn't notice. Okay. Also, uh, I, also, do you know why? Why the second part's called Ball and Jane? Because it's, different... it's two different songs. No, no, Ooh, the, the Ball then? and Chain part. Oh, well, uh, yeah. so talk. So you know how he goes nine months later, new baby boy, baby boy is born. I'm pretty sure it's talking about how children are just a ball and chain to your life. Wow, oh, okay. that's messed up. <laughs> uh, I think that's what he's talking about. We're all some different opinions. Yeah. Because yeah, I won uh, on a ball and chain. These, I you know, I because really... marriage doesn't work in the world today. It's an institution, institution that is in decay. And if I if I have love, I wish to betray. I will surely find another way. Yeah, he's talking about marry how marrying someone is a ball and chain, and then having children is mm. also a ball and chain. You know, I don't really agree with anything Sublime talks about. Damn. Okay. Like, like. I agree with a lot of what they say. Uh, they're basically like the uh, lighter, like, like their their stance on stuff is the lighter version of Rage Against the Machines, who is like revolt, 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 revolt. Rage Against the Machines is just all about revolting against <laughs> the institution. But then, Yo, uh, yeah. I don't know. Just what after after the freedom is just like, yeah, stuff is bad. After that date song, I don't really know. These these guys should be canceled. <laughs> this main singer's dead, Tanner. Oh well, fuck, my bad. Well, so, I mean, they all, I, I mean, I 
No, no, they no, did. They did cancel. Uh, uh, fucking. Uh, what is his name? I forgot. Like the, uh, the, the guitarist or something. No. Um. Con the guy. Uh. You got it. Is he in the? Is he in the band? Sublime? No, he's he's a. Oh. Who is this guy? Genghis Kong. They oh. <laughs> Remember they canceled Bro, I Kong? thought you were talking about someone in the no, album. No, I was not. And then you just talked about Gang. You just brought up Genghis Khan. No, you don't. You don't remember that? They 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 tried to cancel for some. I don't. Remember. How's he gonna apologize? Yeah. I made a severe and continuous lapse in my judgment, and I don't expect to be forgiven. My bad. Genghis Khan's oh, actually the goat. His name is. In Bro's got like a lot of the coolest names. Okay, what's history. your overall rating, Joe Yangs? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, you know, you know, that's where we're at right now. Wait, one more thing, one more thing. I clicked on their profile. Why does this guy... Why does this guy look like Jonah Hill? <laughs> <laughs> he Man, that's Jonah the guy Hill. who makes this music? Oh, hell no. <laughs> um, okay. Full, uh, full rankings of the album. Yes, I gave you. My full ranking was a light 8. Jet. What about you, Tanner oh. Yang? Oh, um, I, I, oh. Gave, I gave it a light 8, too. I gave it a... I give it a flat 9, Yang. Flat 9, oh, okay. Yang. I think that... Flat 9. I think that equals out to a flat 8. Because two... That equals out to... Two light 8s and then a flat 9. So I think... That's a strong 8, Tanner, you stupid dumb... What did, where did you Stupid get that? Dumb. Where did you get that? Put in the calculator. Where did you get that, Jet? Because this isn't you... numbers. If you put... Okay. If you put... 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 Jet. This isn't by numbers. This isn't by numbers. Okay. Me and West... Okay. Me and Weston both gave it a light 8. So that double stacks. See how it would work. So then it'll be a since strong you eight. gave it since you gave it a flat nine. No, I'm pretty sure it would be a strong eight tenor. Yeah, it'd be a strong What eight. the fuck? No, it's strong. No, eight. no, we no, agree. no, no, no. The no, majority agrees. No, no, listen to me, listen to me. I'm this is democracy. No, I'm gonna prove it to you guys. <laughs> See, if it was just democracy if, anymore. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> if it was just me and Jet, and I gave it a light eight. And Jet gave it a flat nine, right? Mm -hmm. Right? Then right, right. that would equal out to a strong eight. Because Jet has the power. But double stacked on light eight, that doesn't make sense if it just goes down one level from Jet if there's two light eights. I mean, yeah, if there's two light eights. Oh! Are you stupid? Do I not make sense right now? Do I not, do I not make sense right now? Do I not make sense right now? Do I not make sense right now? Right, let me a, tell you something. Let me tell you something. It's a flat eight. You, like it's yeah, a flat eight. Yeah, let me tell you something. Let me tell, tell you something. Like, like we can you. agree on it, right? It's a flat eight. Like I just proved it. Sure, I'll, I'll agree with flat eight. Fine, Joe Yang. Uh, ah. No, 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 no. We've Jillian, been doing. We've done almost twenty albums. You guys still understand? Okay. What yeah. <laughs> What's the next album that we're doing? Ten. We it's didn't not, even talk about our not. favorite aspect and our worst aspect, or like least favorite. I don't, I don't give a fuck about that. <laughs> <laughs> also, it's not my choice. It's it's uh, Weston's turn for the next album. What's our next album, Weston Maddox Morley? Uh -huh. Oh shoot, I just oh, I it. forgot. <laughs> Isn't it? Uh, yeah, you sure. forgot. <laughs> I don't, I don't Dude, remember. You know what it is. You know what it is. Addy, Addy's album. Oh right, my my dear sister Adeline decided to pick my next album. And our next album is going to be Folk Folklore by Taylor <laughs> Swift, and she is going to join us and do most of the talking for me because I don't give a oh, shit, yeah. and she does. So we'll and have Adeline Morley on for the next episode to uh, help us discuss Taylor Swift because I mean I don't think Jet would really want to talk about Taylor Swift that much. I like I like Taylor Swift, and I like I like Taylor Swift. I like the, I like I Taylor Swift. 1989 is a really good album, but we're doing folklore because that's what Addy chose for some reason. For some um, Joe Young. But yeah, next week, or well, this yeah, weekend, um, catch us listening to some folklore, guys. Yeah. By Taylor folklore. Swift. 
Uh, this was our review of 40 Ounces to Freedom by Sublime. Yes. Our average rating was a flat 8 out of 10. 10. We hope you guys... <laughs> Why is there a uh, purple Ella trap in my my mom's bedroom? Libro, bro. I don't think that's an Ella trap. <laughs> you, should, you, should, you, you should write it out of adjective. Okay, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Bye! Yeah, that's right. I'll see you guys next week.